Let's face it, cops on TV series are the worst cops ever. Blue Bloods, SUV, Hawaii Five-O, Chicago PD, especially Chicago PD. First of all, here's something they should teach you at police college. When trying to sneak up on a felon at his hideout, don't send in six cars with lights and sirens and screeching tires. Also, when trying to nab a suspect on the street, wait until you're on the same side of the street and closer than 50 feet before you call out his name. Now I know in TV these things are necessary because they lead to A, the shootout with police through a broken window, and B, the chase across a busy road and down an alley, necessary to save on writing more shitty dialogue. But think about it, if these guys were real cops, they'd be shit. That's why I've always loved private eye shows. Not just because of the sport jackets, but because they do the cops and robbers thing without being cops. So when they bust heads and break the law, they aren't the guys supposed to be enforcing it. Think about the police procedures and justice system cop shows feed us. The cops are always up against two enemies, criminals and the legal system. Laws aren't seen as things which protect our rights. They're shown as regulations that interfere with an honest cop's job. What the hell? Can you imagine a surgeon rebelling against wearing gloves or washing his hands? Does it waste time he should be spending in the operating room? And the hero cop works either alone or with a puppy dog sidekick, but treats the rest of the force like a pain in the ass. Stop barking! A person who wants to work alone and who resents rules and then joins a vast organization dedicated to enforcing rules is in need of basic career counseling. But we watch these characters and root for them because they're on our side. No, they're not. If you're facing a criminal charge and you're innocent, you want cops in a legal system that colors inside the lines to prove you're guilty, not plays fast and loose because they don't like the look of you. TV cops rely on instinct, on their gut. You know what their gut isn't? Evidence, except of a bad diet. In the real world, would you want to be in the crosshairs of a cop who will beat you with a phone book because his gut says you're guilty? Have you seen their guts? So TV cops are not good cops. You know what you get when you get cops convinced someone's guilty and bend the rules to ensure a conviction? A 10-part Netflix series. Yeah, soak that in. You know what else TV cops do all the time that real cops don't? Always say, we're done here. Take a shot of bourbon every time a cop says that in an episode. You'll be shit-faced by the third commercials. Anyway, I've made my point. We're done here.